Hello everybody, Luna here once again with another episode of This Song Means What? Which is a show where we take your favorite songs and we break down the lyrics to let you know what they really mean. And uh, so I am here with my friend Terry. Hello. Hello. How are y'all? And uh, we are going to talk about and break down the lyrics to Olivia Newton-John's mm. I Honestly Love You. So, I love her. I would guess that that's... Um, 70s country yeah i think Does it was late right? 70s yeah late 70s yeah, mid yeah, yeah. late 70s yeah and so you like so you know the song i'm familiar with the you know the basics of it okay it's been forever since i've heard it so i couldn't tell you what it's about gotcha well um what just from the title what do you think it's about she honestly loves some man it's got to be i know it's kind of a slow speed song if i recall mm -hmm. so all right i'm sure it's a love story Gotcha. All right. Well, let's find out. We're going to listen to the lyrics. You ready? Ready. All right. Here we go. I think she's a hoe. <laughs> I think Why that she's that? married because we both know I've got somewhere else I'm supposed to be, but uh, here I am hanging out with you, and quite honestly, mm -hmm. I love you. Mm, so I'm thinking she's already married. Oh, I've never really thought of that I, on the, with that line. I had no idea that what, what yeah. that song was about. Yeah, if it is. Because she says, um, we both know I've got somewhere else to go. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Is that your take? Um. It it wasn't, but it makes sense. Where you know she's she she could be doing other. I, I saw it as she could be doing other things, but you might be right. It might be because she has this regular life that she has maybe not. And, maybe. Let's listen. Oh no! All right, cool. Here we go. Okay. Mm, he wasn't that receptive to it. No. She could see by the look in his eyes that he was not feeling, feeling it. the same thing. Right. Yeah. Um, maybe it was better left unsaid. Yeah. I can see it in your eye. Yeah. Yeah. So this is, uh, it's not necessarily a love song. This is kind of like a breakup song, sort of, so far. Hmm. It's not reciprocal, anyways. Not from the hmm. other person. That's huh. heartbreaking. Yeah. All right, here we go.
It's getting sadder and sadder. <laughs> she's bearing her heart, and he's not feeling it. That's what I'm, what I'm seeing. Yeah, and she, I, in those lyrics, she said pretty much like, okay, well, I'm glad I said it anyway because I have the chance to say it now, and so you should take that chance no matter what to say it even though you don't know what the outcome is going to be. But it's not looking good. Mm -mm. It's not a lot of song left for this to turn around. <laughs> All right, here we go. All there's right. there's still more. There's still more. to both be married yeah i've got mine and you've got yours mm -hmm. and he was shocked that she was bringing it up but they've been spending time together and she got feelings for him mm. she blurted it out and he did not have the reaction she was expecting that's yeah. what i get out of it yeah and it, it's i mean that's i never thought of that there at the end because I, for me she says you know if if we were both born in another place in time this moment might be ending in a kiss but there you are with yours, and here I am with mine. Like, we're going to keep our kisses. But you might be right, because there is this ongoing thing through the whole thing where it almost seems like they have two different lives, but they have this little, well, she has this little connection to the other person, and it was not reciprocal. Yeah. Hmm. And isn't it funny how everyone thinks this is a love song? I thought it was. <laughs> 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 and it's kind of the opposite. Of course, when this came out, you and I were children, so. I know, I know. Um, but you know what What I think is funny about this song is um, back in the day when there would be dedications on the radio where you would write in and say, I dedicate this to this. All of the couples that oh, we yeah. knew of in our junior high and high school, everyone would dedicate I Honestly Love You to their loved one. And, and I was a big lyrics person, so I thought, oh, my God, they're if they only knew what they're dedicating to each other. <laughs> yeah. I would have thought the same as a kid. He yeah. Dedicated it. Huh. Well, there you have it, everybody. I Honestly Love You is not really a love song. What would you call it? It's a heartbreaking song. It's a heartbreaking song. So there you go. Um, I want to thank Terry for being a part of this episode. If, please uh, feel free to like and comment and give us suggestions on any songs that you would love for us to break down the lyrics to. Until then, I am Luna. This is Terry for... This song means what? And we will see you next time. Thanks for having me on. Bye. <laughs>